Then now I, I, I'm going to show you more feature uh, of this software. There is another panel here. It can be another way to read the information on RFID tag. So on this panel, you can select EPC, you can select TID, you can select user, pan, uh, user band. Okay. Moreover, you can use this panel to write. Because RFID UHF tag is rewritable, um, that is uh, that is not a uh, read only. You can you can change the information on that. You can define additional information you want and write to the tag for your application. Of course, as said, TID number cannot be changed because it is factory defined. But EPC and user you can define whatever you want. Base, make, just make sure it's, uh, it's compiling to the standard. So uh, let me show you. Uh. Now when I click EPC, uh, click, click the back, click the back, uh, display first. Click EPC, I click with, and I put the tag on it. Okay. Now this is the EPC number. I I stop, I change to with TID, I read. Now the TID number is another number, different from EPC. I stop and I take user, I read. Now you see everything is zero. That means I haven't defined anything for the user data. Okay, now I try to write. Like for example, I write one two three four to the tag. Like I put the tag on the on the reader first and click Y. Now like you see now now like this for, for this tag, all the all the information of user data is zero. Nothing written. Now I write. Okay. Now and I then I read again. Now do you see? One two three four. One two three four. Um, the data will will be uh written to the memory based on the address I defined, because I did, I I have defined the address from the start. So one two three four just start from the very beginning, and write one by one.